It all started with a piece of paper. I sailed across the ocean from country to country for five years on the Beagle, ventured through a tropical forest for the first time and found fossils. I experienced my first earthquake and saw the effects in rising levels of land. Finally, I saw the finches with different beak sizes on different islands. After the beagle, it hit me. This is... evolution. I studied hard and began my research to come up with this book that will tell people all about my discoveries. Overproduction! More offspring are produced by an organism that can possibly survive? Variation! Each individual differs from all other members of a species, some more than others. Adaptation allows organisms to become- I told people to about it, but we never met eye to eye. One day, Charles Lyle came to me and told me about a paper that he received from Alfred Wallace. He saw that there was a connection between his paper and my work, so he wanted me to publish my theory to establish priority. I went home and started studying again. It's time. If I release it, who knows what the townspeople might do to me. No, but I must release it. People need to read what I saw. No, but I can't. People don't believe in science. We believe in creationism. He's crazy. I'm telling you, he's crazy. No, I can't. No, I can't. Be. It's clear that God made the universe, God made everything, and he went to that conclusion. I am Charles Darwin, and this is my story.